Hey everybody, what's going on? This is Brandon here, and today I'm going to show you how to download and install a plugin on your Craft Bucket server. And as always, guys, please give the video a like, be sure to subscribe, and thank you to all my subscribers. You guys are awesome. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you're going to do is just open up your server folder, and you're going to locate your plugins folder. You double click on it, you're going to see there's nothing in there. So what you're going to have to do is go to Safari or your web browser and go to plugins.bucket.org. And this is the official page to download all these awesome plugins. Now the plugin we're going to download for this video is going to be World Edit. So if you type it in, just like I did, with a capital W and a capital E, all one word, and you search it, the first one that's going to come up is World Edit. Now this has some really good tools for building worlds. You have the wand tool where you can select blocks and change them. And it's really good and it helps out a lot when you're building real big structures. So when you get to this page, we're just going to go to the download button here. And we're going to go to this. It's going to say, here it is, download it. We'll click the download button once more. And as you see, it's already downloaded. So now what we do is we get a file. We're just going to drag it to the desktop. And we're going to go ahead and close our window. We don't need the browser anymore. So we're going to open up this folder and there's only one thing we need out of here and it's that worldedit.jar. Let's just drag that to the desktop and then we'll just delete the folder that we downloaded. So if we go into our bucket server and we go, we take this jar file, what we're going to do is just drag it into the plugins folder and that's it. So now we're going to double click the start dot command. As you can see this bash window opens so I'll close it. And then we're just going to let this window open and it's going to load that plugin as the server generates. And you can see world edit loading world edit and it loaded just fine. As you can see it added a few different things to the folder. And if you go into your plugins folder, you'll notice world edit has a file now where it has some stuff you can configure and do all that good stuff. So that's pretty much it guys. When you want to download a plugin, just make sure that you're only putting the jar file into your plugins folder. Some people take that whole folder and throw it in here and their plugin fails to load and they don't know why. Well, because all you need is the jar file in the plugins folder. So hopefully this video helped you out guys. If it did, please give it a like. Be sure to subscribe. Thank you to my subscribers. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you guys all in the next video.